completely weary. I feel emptied out and devoid of words. My thoughts are jumbled, and my heart is agonized and burdened. My grieving soul goes out to you in distress. How can I ever stop the endless years that overcome me during the day and drench my pillow at night? How do I stop the bottomless pain and weariness that have now permanently taken control of my being? Yeah. I wish there were any means somewhere that would bring you back. I wish there was something, just anything, that could have been to stop the horror of your and brutal death that has been etched on my mind ever since. My stomach churns and not the pain whenever I think about the way you died. Yeah, how could such a thing happen to you of all people? My gentle, unassuming, humble, but sophisticated brother who lived an absolutely peaceful life. My brother, my friend, how I wish I could bring you back to life continue to be my travel companion on this earthly journey. All I have are an answered question as I look back to that tragic evening of your demise. When you visited on that Thursday evening, nothing hinted are the impending horror lurking in the dark, waiting to pounce. You were your usual calm and honest and amusing self. We chatted, joked, and laughed as we often did. I have since asked myself a million times why I did not ask you to stay overnight. I have berated myself endlessly for perhaps not praying enough for you. I have wondered if there was something I should or could have done that shielded you from the undeserved pain awaiting you that night. However, I keep praying fervently that God will give you deserving justice. It is my ardent prayer that your confidence in life, your simplicity and excellent spirit will, will inspire others, especially our children and all your cherished students you taught with such devotion to achieve greatness in your memory and honor. I thank you for being my rock, a supportive and generous brother, and for touching the lives of my children with your kindness and love. It is my constant prayer that God will keep you safe in his comforting grace and grant you everlasting peace. I will hold you close in my heart until we meet again. The year, yeah. Only after, only after we see Jojo.